All right, Corey with Austin Fit Magazine here with Austin Vandegrift, a Region 4 champ today here at Corpus Christi with 27 points, 15 46 average, 36 second spread. Uh, let's introduce everybody one by one. I'm Brody Lurso. Hudson Haley. Kyle McCullough, Jr. I'm Miles Nutt, I'm a junior. Colin Goodwin, I'm a sophomore. Christian Castor Cruz, I'm a senior. Jackson Stafford, I'm a senior. Jack Ebuyer, senior. Adrian Dolakia, senior. Anderson Mills, freshman. All right, let's just start with the performance here at Regions. Obviously, a tough course, hot day, um, but you still got it done as a squad. What's it sort of say about this team that you're coming out here? Challenging day, but you're able to get it done. Uh, I mean, we came out here and we did what we wanted to do. We qualified for state, and uh, you know, it's a pretty good finish all around team wise. Yeah, we were really just happy how we performed. Like, even in this heat, it's really good that we were able to still stay consistent regardless of the weather and the way Corpus is. It's hot, it's humid, all that stuff. So, pretty happy with that. Yeah, nothing special, just another race to get us to state and that's where we're really focused at this stage obviously i think you know your plans are beyond state are you still building training wise yeah we haven't pulled back much we're really going to take it off for state nxr mainly nxn that's our focus so this was just another race to kind of you know shake the legs off just one last one last stretch through training and then we'll really start pulling it back and i already said that sorry for state yeah i know you know 36 seconds for any team is, is just stunning. I mean, how do you guys race? I mean, we got three, four, five guys today. Like, can you talk a little bit about strategy and structure of where you want to stay within the pack? Uh, yeah, definitely. I think we kind of try to go out conservative a little bit and just stay at 5K pace from the start as a group and just spread out throughout the race. And then last mile, we just try to send it as much as possible. But yeah. I would just say generally we try to make each mile faster than the last and that normally gets us the time we want. Yeah. Is, is send it a, a team slogan yeah. by chance? Uh, no. Maybe no. like the last like 200 maybe, but definitely not at the beginning. We're not the kind of team to send it. Yeah, I'd say the way we race is that we try and stay in threshold for uh, as no. long as no. possible. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> or at least we try and stay in controlled for as long yeah. as possible That's until better. You know that that last like one or two k where we send it. Okay. Now you guys have gotten to the state championships again, where the you know the stakes are a little bit higher, the pressure is obviously a little higher. How do you you know manage emotions or just expectations as as a team? Because obviously, you know this is where you want to be, but obviously you got to keep yourself grounded too. Um, I think I think we all like kind of know what we want to hit, and um, yeah, we we go out and try to hit that, but I don't think. If we don't hit that, or like if we go faster, I don't think it really changes much. Like we all know that we're, obviously we're a pretty good team. Um, I think we think we know that, so no bad performance is gonna change that. Um, I think we like to keep keep our confidence high. We know that we're gonna come through the pack uh, in that you know second, third mile, whatever it is. Um, yeah. I'm just thinking I'm just really happy that our team's just getting more and more confident with every race. We're narrowing that spread each race. If you look at the beginning of the season, it's really cut down. I think it was like a minute 15 or something, the very first race of the season, and now we're getting down in the 30-second spread, which is really awesome because we want each person of our team to be as close together as possible because that's really where it's going to matter at NXR, NXN, State, for sure. Yeah. What's oh, were you going to say that? No, 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 I'm good for that. Oh, I, I was going to ask, is it, I know you don't want, you know, secrets in track, but you want to keep, like, the workouts pretty close, but is there any great workout that you guys have done that has been good for this team? We don't have a whole lot of um, really shiny workouts. Most of ours are controlled threshold. I know we've said that in the past, but I will say maybe our biggest workout that gets us fit quickly are our tempo progressions, and we have done a few long run progressions, but mostly just long runs with thresholds. Our famous video, I'm just kidding, no, no. But I think just that cumulative uh, work, you know, in easy runs and in workouts has done a lot for us. I mean, you look at our guys like Colin right there. He wasn't even running in track season. He was having an illness working through, and 
in like a month he went from not even being able to run three miles to being one of the top guys in the state just from that consistency. So nothing really special. Yeah. As a group though, you guys have been special. Congratulations getting to the state championships. Best of luck, right? Thank, Thank you, you so much.